Yeah, harvesting's all the way along there. Two seconds to, oh, it's no, a bit too late now. Do I get off? Yeah, you can get off there. Oh, there you are. Okay. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot, Ben. Sorry about this. Yeah, there's quite a lot of people downstairs. Don't, be, don't worry, people downstairs. I've not forgot about you. I didn't know you were there. Got my third eye, keeping an eye on you. Well, anyway, if you look to your left and right, you can see Halford Street. Now, looking out to the right of Halford Street is just Halford Street. But looking up to your left is Halford Street. Now, that side of Halford Street is home to the Curve Theatre. Now, it's taken over from the Haymarket Theatre, which has now just been abandoned. This sit sets off in a minute. We can't really jump red lights, but now we can. If you keep looking to your left, you can actually see the edge of the Curve Theatre. There's going to be loads and loads of theatres in there, loads of screens. You can sit back and watch a wonderful movie in there. Great day out that is in there. Now we're going to take you back to London Road Railway. If you don't wish to get off there, please don't forget to give me a wave again. I say, if you do love me, you can't just stay on, you know. Now, if you keep looking for that blue building right there, it doesn't look too amazing. But it was actually the media a little while ago. It's the this ugliest building. Now you can see with all the, the dingy coloured looking windows on it. But that's getting improved now. Now it's going to be offices, apartments, all nice fancy offices for retail and leisure. So look absolutely amazing. Now, I take it most of you have heard about the tragic fire Madeline campaign. Now, if you look into your left, you'll see the Royal, not Royal Mail, what are we talking about? The Leicester Mercury office. Where the Leicester Mercury is printed, also the Metro. Now, the little green and yellow flag on top is for, to support fire Madeline. It also tells you the temperature and everything. It's cooled down a bit now, compared to what it was earlier. Now, Mr. Thomas Cook used to do package holidays. He's quite a small man. But he started his package holidays from Campbell Street, just down there. You know, PC Plum standing there now. Give him a wave. Oh, he won't wait back. That's where Mr. Thomas Cook started to pack his holidays. But now, you can see Mr. Thomas Cook. Well, I've set a line a bit there. You can see his statue. Now, he's quite a small man. He's checking we're on time down there. You can just catch him there. 